say, but here we go. Okay, this engine is now running on wood gas. I had to shut it off because it makes too much noise. But the wood gas goes into the engine. This is used to control the amount of oxygen mixed with the wood gas to be burned in the engine. But to make this system even more efficient, what I've done is taken the exhaust gas from this engine and I've diverted it into a coil which is sitting inside this bucket of water. So the heat from the engine is that now heating the water which I could use for heating my shop. The exhaust then, once being cooled, comes out this pipe at the bottom of the coil. And this is what's really neat about this type of gasifier. One of the hoses, of course, is going to the outside of the building to get rid of the exhaust gas so we don't die of carbon monoxide poisoning. The other hose is hooked to the other part of the T, and this exhaust gas is now taken to this valve, and exhaust gas is now put back into the reactor. This is important for two things. Number one, this carbon monoxide or carbon dioxide and the water vapor which are in the exhaust gas drop down into this hot reaction zone and help cool it down. The water vapor and the carbon dioxide are reacted on by the hot charcoal in there to make carbon monoxide and free hydrogen or methane. So in essence, I'm taking my exhaust gas and also using it as a type of fuel to help keep my reactor going, uses less charcoal, and keeps the temperature down. Now, inside my fuel hopper, I have different types of fuel, because this gasifier can use different types of fuel. My fuel of choice would be little chunks of wood. Okay. Having cellulose, which is made of hydrogen, oxygen, and carbon, these are ideal because the hydrogen, of course, is burned, the oxygen is used to make carbon monoxide, and the carbon then makes more charcoal. Well, if I don't have wood chips, I can use wood pellets. I've used these very successfully in this unit. Uh, these are made up of pressed sawdust, so they're a high density fuel, uh, but wood pellets don't work well in wood gasifiers, but they do work well in this type of charcoal gasifier. I have used sawdust. The problem with sawdust is it's a very low density fuel, but if I can get it moving through the auger into the wood gasifier, it does work because it also has the hydrogen. It's just the density is not there. I've also used corn. You could use oats. Anything that you can put through that auger that has carbon, hydrogen in it will work as a fuel. I have even used plastic. These are pieces of ground up plastic that when it drops into that very hot reaction zone, melts, but then it's vaporized into carbon monoxide. And the hydrogen in this um, plastic also is used as a fuel in the engine. I've even used motor oil, used motor oil. And right now in this hopper, here is kind of a mixture of stuff that I'm using. Uh, there's a wood pellet. You see the corn in there. They're pieces of plastic. I've even thrown in some chunks of charcoal. And this other black stuff is actually sawdust soaked in motor oil. And this is a fuel that works very well in here. Point is, it has to be able to go through the auger. What's amazing that I found, something amazing I found out about using this and developing this system is the, there's very little odor. You don't smell burning plastic. You don't smell burning corn. There's really very clean combustion using this type of gasifier into this type of engine. So, I'll 
hit the auger. And we'll fire up the engine again. Make some electricity, and we'll make some heat. I guess pine wood. Electric starts are not underrated, by the way. But this works every time. I need to get a, a fresh batch of gas through here, so I turned on the fan. Create the draw. I'm going to add auger a little more fuel. This is the combustion zone. That fuel will enrich in it with hydrogen. We'll test it. See, that's why the engine didn't run because it had sat there. cold start, it takes about five minutes to get gas rich enough to run an engine. I'll auger in a little more. Try it without using gasoline. Straight down in there. I did. Go up. No, then I gotta run the hop this. Okay, go ahead. You gotta watch him. Go ahead, continue. Okay, ready? Here it goes. Are you going in? Do it again. Go ahead. Yeah, I can see it. Glowing quite a bit more. Okay, do it again. It's going to be pretty bright. Yeah, I'm going to open it up. So, what's happening when you open this up? I'm putting uh, exhaust gas in here. Oh, I see. Uh -huh. That's cooling down. Uh huh. 